How's it going, everyone? I'm FeatherGamer555, and welcome back to more The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, I don't remember what we did. I think we returned to Kakariko, if I remember correctly, but it's been a few days since I recorded this game. Not to you guys, it's been like the normal uploading time span, but for me, it's been a few days because I actually got sick in my mass recording session of playing this game, and... So I had to take like three, four days off because I couldn't talk properly. My voice was like shot and it was kind of frustrating, but I'm better now. I mean, I'm still kind of sick. I mean, if you, you can probably hear it in my voice still, but I, I can talk now. So what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to backtrack because I've got bombs finally. So we're going to backtrack to Zor's domain and we're going to hunt a bug play a game, to have a great time, so, it's a pretty basic episode, but it's enough of an episode that I missed from this book, and that I'm going to fix up now, because of bombs, so I'm gonna beat that guy up real quickly, because I didn't like the way he was looking at me, I don't know, <laughs> I don't like how he was looking at me, anyway, so long since I played this. Which is weird, because it honestly has it. Okay. I think this is where I need to shoot. Deal with the Tektite. Deal with the Bulbin. Oh! Waste my bomb! Thanks a lot, you idiot. There we go. Stupid tectite. Oh, it feels nice to be able to go up here again. Sorry, I'm going to be drinking water every so often in this episode, just so I don't lose my throat again. <laughs> Alright, Zoro's Domain. Where do we want to start here? We got those stag beetles. Okay. Uh, nothing too big here, but I'll take the 50 rupee that looks like it's up there. Okay, I'll take that. Hmm. What's that? Looks like a rupee. There we go. Oh, look at that. We get some rupees for it, too. I'll take it. Oh, it feels so good busting these walls down. I love having bombs again. I honestly missed it. Yeah, I, I really want the 50 that they're claiming is in here. I want to rob the Zoras here. <laughs> okay. Oh, I know how this works. Hello, Zoras. There we go, that should be our 50 that I'm looking for. That away. There we go, that's really all we can do here. Get the 50 rupees. Get a service, and now what we want to do is we want to look for a male dragonfly. We didn't have this? I'm just going to make sure. Because for some reason I feel like we do, but I'm pretty sure we don't. Nah, we don't have a dragonfly. No dragonflies. Okay. That's clearly not in here. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to be in the water or else I'm going to like fall down. Okay. That's on the ledge over here, so I can just from looking on the map I can see where to go. I'm not going to fall down, am I? 
You got me way up here. Uh, I guess I'll jump down. <laughs> That's probably not what I'm supposed to do, but if we're lucky, one of these Zoras will catch me. Okay, poor Zora didn't help me out. You're a meanie. You know, this is the perfect time just to put on the new armor. I could swim faster in this. Oh no, that's just for diving. And I clearly haven't done it in a while. Well, it is kind of faster. Oh, that's it. Hello, little dragonfly. Alright, so that was the male one. We need the female one, which is not as easy to find. Okay, I, I'll see that. Kind of popped out pretty nicely, with the first one. What's that? Is that it? No, that's not it, because... Oh, yeah, I'm not going to fight with that. <laughs> I'm not fighting with that. That fights with the rapids. Okay, creepy Zora. I keep forgetting I can't, I don't need to press A. All A is doing is make me go down, which I don't really need to do. Maybe there's an easier way to get out than just swimming through the cave. Wait, is that it? No, it's a Zora. Zoras. Wait, what's this guy up here sell? That's really annoying. Every time I go barely near the ledge, it jumps off on me. Is this a store? Nope. Okay. Well, you bummed my joy. Thanks a lot, buddy. Oh, it's morning. Good. I don't like when it's night. It's just too much dead silence in the game, and I can't stand that. Like, they don't even have songs for it. Uh, where was the signpost supposed to be? What kind of signpost were they talking about? Because that's all I remember them saying. Oh, okay. This is more... Wait, I think that's it. Yep, there it is. No, 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 no. You! Over here. Got it. Female dragonfly. Alright. Oh, that stops us right in front of... Issa's place, which is good, because we need to be here. Hmm? A customer? Sorry, but we're temporarily closed. Why not? Ow. Is it because I'm wearing the outfit? <laughs> Shouldn't be. What? I said we're closed. Now scram. No! What the heck? Here goes the book where they just all of a sudden they. What? Okay. Uh, I wanna play! I didn't miss anything. No. Oh, 
Okay, so my game won't. T she won't talk to me, but in the book, it claims that she'll just talk to you and invite you. Like what? <laughs> Maybe this is actually the stone. One of the like the stone I'm supposed to howl to. Maybe it was that one. Uh, fishing hole. I don't want to do the fishing hole yet. I want to know why you're not talking to me. Whoa. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I'll take it. I didn't know that was gonna happen. Even though the book says it right there, I didn't even notice it. Wow. How did I not see this? Well, I don't have to scream now. Where's the other one? Ow. Over here. Buddies. Buddy, you're, this one's being stupid. <laughs> this one's being stupid. He's just sitting there. The other one was doing something, but the other guy... Uh, no. I don't feel like moving. Whoa, that scared me. Who are you? How can you keep cool fighting monsters like that? Uh, wow, you... Wow, what a champ you are. Well, what are we standing around jawing for? Come on, inside. There we go, that's what I wanted. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't even know these guys were gonna appear. Golly. Talk about scary, I thought it was done for. Things have been getting pretty crazy around here, let me tell you. So thanks for earlier. My name's Iza. I rent boats here. Well, I used to rent boats here, but then we had a rock fall and it dammed the river up. Yeah, I could sure use a helpful guy around at times like this. Yep, a handy guy would sure be a big helper on you. Oh. Really? You're a lifesaver. Well, do you think you could do something about that rock? I'll give you some bombs and arrows, so you just put them together and shoot bomb arrows at that thing. Hoo -ah! Done. You did it. Well, my gal tells me there are still some rocks blown, blocking the way along the river, so you should take care of those, too. Here's the boat. Hop in. All right. I love doing this. It's so much fun. No, it's a teensy bit dangerous down river up here, so don't leave the boat, okay? One of our part-timers is waiting down there, so you can get the details from her. And when you're done, you can keep that bomb bag and everything in it as a token of my appreciation. So, be seeing ya. So it, uh, what we want to do is we want to shoot the rock walls that are kind of littered around. I'm going to get hip out. Ah! Busy trying to take down these walls, I'm just getting wrecked. Whoa! Okay, I, I don't know how boats work. I just keep going the opposite way. This is like me playing Mario Sunshine over here. I just keep shooting the wrong way and then I go backwards and it's like, what is happening? Okay, that way goes that way and this way goes this way. Ah, you've come at the request of the shop owner, haven't you? Well, I'm in her. I'm in her employ, part time for now. I'm sorry we're troubling you so. You see, these rocks are blocking the natural flow of the river. All you need to do is use your bomb arrows to destroy the blockage. There you go. That wasn't hard. 
You did it, thank you. And, ah, uh, and the water has already begun to flow. Then I shall guide you to the mouth of the river. Follow me. Give me a sec, I might end up hitting another wall. Get out of the way, wall. I don't like you, wall. Okay, what are we doing? Like, a <laughs> white ro water rap in here? A rapids here? I just like went flying for it. That's not a good thing. It's kind of dangerous. So, so much Mario Sunshine trolling here. I'm clearly never gonna go boating because I, the water screws me over. <laughs> it's just like it changes the controls on me, and it's like what? Ah, that was horrible. I was doing a terrible job at that. We. Oh my gosh, that was dangerous. I'm such a help safe D nut. Good job out there. Yeah, no kidding, I like got wrecked. You have truly done us a great service. Now the shop can finally reopen. When we were closed, my boss's temper only got worse and worse. It was a rough time for us all. Oh, and another thing. I don't suppose she promised anything special for doing this, did she? Just the bomb bag, right? Yes, she tends to bribe people with whatever's lying around. So stingy, really. Just like Twilight Princess. <laughs> but it's to do with bombs, so I'll let it slide. It's alright, I'll let her know you kept it when I get back. You got bag a bag with bombs. When empty, you can fill the bag with one type of bomb at a time. The maximum number of bombs depends on the type. Now if you'll excuse me, come visit at the shop sometime. I will, like right away. Probably. Yep. Didn't they already have a bomb bag? Like, what was the point of giving another one? Ah well. All right, so now. Yeah, so I want to go back up there. Great, so I gotta climb all the way back. So what's with the bird? I tried to communicate with this bird before, and he just said you're stupid or whatever. Still, it doesn't have... He's too good for me. You know what? I'm too good for him. I'm not gonna talk to him. So I save someone and go climbing all the way back up there? Ah... Yep. All right. We're climbing back up. Which kind of sucks, because for one, how the heck do I get out of here? I'll just put the Zora outfit on and hopefully be able to travel fast enough. I hate that it dives you in the water first. Oh, I can't believe I have to climb all the way up. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna complain now. Leave me be to complain about everything that is traveling in this game. This is a lot. I 
I'm just gonna go talk to Fire over here. At least he'll just shoot me up there. Not all the way up there, but like back to. Actually, I have no choice. I have to go there to get up there. Fire! Yes, I'm back. Give it a shot. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do -do -do -do. I'm not watching that. <laughs> okay. I am just... How many times... No, I want to jump off backwards. It's quicker. Ah. Ow. So I seriously, I, I feel like there is a faster way up there and I'm making this a long trip. Again, when can I warp? <laughs> I need it. I'm just sick of traveling by foot. This is so much work. There we go. I need to get up the gun. Wait, so is this way faster or something? Why was there just Rupee sitting there? Oop, I don't have anything and I'm just kind of pushing opponent there a little bit much. I didn't like that guy. <laughs> I didn't like him either. They're all uh, stupid. There we go, got a total of 600 rupees, not bad. I feel like there was a faster way up here. And then having to climb all the way. No, there shouldn't be, or else then I would have done it earlier. There needs to be a quicker way up here. I hate traveling. I should have read the book more. Who reads? Actually, me. Ow. I'm surprised they didn't die from that. Not gonna lie. Would I end up having to travel back up again, though? I think so. I hope not. I could actually blow that up if I chose to. Hang on, there's a, like, what is, oh wait, no mind. I'll go there later. We're back. Again. To play your violent boating game hey welcome thanks you we're back in business well we can't offer much but just make yourself at home and of course if you want a boat ride just let me know I'd be happy to rent you one okay before I do this okay For a rental fee of 200 rupees, you get a boat and a guy. You want me? You want one? I, I read that wrong. Anyway, we're gonna do it again. It's gonna be fun. You all set. Have a good ride.
Oh, I want the red one. Got it. Red is good. You want red more. Yellow is kind of a bland, not a bland color. Not a point worthy color. I mean, you hit a lot of them, you'll rack up points. Oh, if you hit things though. Well, this is not fair. The water hates me. That is not fair. I didn't know it was going to take away points. Who sucks at driving a boat. That's the game not letting me move. Thanks a lot, game. Oh girl, it's not that cheap, I'm doing decent. I just feel like it's cheap, because I can't turn. Okay, what? Who resets up garbage in the river? That is not even eco-friendly. Twenty-five, but that, that means not hitting a wall, and the game is so rigged for it. Ah! Do I actually have to climb up this crappy thing again? <laughs> Go down sideways. That was a good idea. Really? Ah. Please tell me you could just get me back up there. On this trip down river, you scored 22 points, destroying territory. That's too bad, yeah. Well, so, yes. Yes. Okay. We're gonna do it again, and again, and again, and again, until we get it. I will not lose to this game. Ah. It's the outfit. It's throwing me off. Why I would blame an outfit? I'm not... I'm gonna focus this time clearly, because I'm not even saying a word here. No, I'm too busy endlessly going toward this flippin' wall. This wall is scaring me. Here we go. The wall will not leave me alone. It's getting too close. Oh, I always think that's a wall, and it is a wall. What kind of crap wall is this? What kind of organization, business are you pulling here? So that was dangerous. This is just a wall in the way. Like, are you joking me? I can't even have a chance.
Oh, that shot was horrible. Turn game. Like, look at this crap. Really? I'm like perfectly slamming the stupid thing to the direction I need, and it's not moving. It's obsessing over the wall. I need all of these to win. Ah! There we go. Oh my gosh. Ugh. That was not fun. Never again do I want to play your violent boat game. Stupid boats. Too dangerous. You shouldn't be shooting bombs with arrows on a boat. Too dangerous. Oh my gosh. Are we done with this? I hope so, because I don't want to look at it again. <laughs> on this trip down river, you score 26 points, destroying targets. Congratulations, as the first customer to score at least 25 points, you receive this prize. Giant bomb bag. It can hold twice as many bombs as ordinary bomb bags. The exact number it can hold depends on which kind on the kind of bomb. Come again anytime. I won't Yeah, but I gotta go back up there. In the next episode. This one's done. I've had it. <laughs> Goodbye. Wait, are you gonna just climb the Is it actually possible? You just... Magic. The power of magic. Are you gonna talk to me now? You stupid bird. I have no need to speak to humans. Yeah, well, you know what? I'm not gonna do that. Bombs are a fragile item. You can only have so many at a time. Anyway, that was an interesting episode. It was actually kind of entertaining, but a little difficult for me. I mean, riding that boat, I suck at it already. It, it, like, it's fun, but I suck at it. And I was just driving into walls, and oh my gosh. Who knew that hitting walls so much costed you everything on that? But clearly it did, and I had trouble for that. But either way. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, show your support, hit that like button. Thank you if you do so, because that makes you awesome. And also subscribe for more Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Alright, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.